Stoneworms Tag Channel here, and today I'm doing a video about the iPhone SE for Verizon Prepaid. So, the new iPhone SE is not here at Verizon Prepaid, it's available now in three colors Starlight, Product Red, or Midnight. Uh, so yeah, the 64 gb white iPhone SE is 429.99. The 128 gig is 469.99, and then the 256 gb version is 599.99, and they're all in stock, so that's really good there. Uh, so this is the new iPhone SE. Did you guys know what it looks like? It has an outdated design. So, um, yeah. So, on the front of you, you guys have your, uh, earpiece, phone facing camera, and your touch ID. Right side of the front has your power button, left side has your volume keys, and your alert switch. On the back of the front is your camera, camera flash, and Apple logo. This is the back of the day, like I said, your camera, camera flash, and Apple logo. And your, uh, SIM card is on the right side of the phone. It's like right here on the right side of the phone now. That's where your SIM card is. And this is the back there. There it is in the three colors. There's the right side. And there's the back with like cases on it. So, yeah. So the only thing I don't like about the new iPhone is that the design is outdated. It's like a six years old design. So I don't like the design. But other than that, the specs on that are pretty good. Uh, so if you guys are looking to get a cheap iPhone with 5G, the iPhone SE is the phone for you. So the iPhone SE has a 12 megapixel wide camera with an f with the f amperature, digital zoom up to five times, portrait mode with advanced bouquet and depth camera control, 2.65 inches in width, 5.45 inches in height. And up to 15 hours of usage time there. So it says here Lightning Fast A15 Bionic Chip and Fast 5G, big time battery life, and a superstar camera, plus the toughest class in a smartphone, and a home button with the secure touch ID. This device supports 5G ultra wideband. Mid, it supports 5G ultra wideband mid band, which supports C band, 5G nationwide, and 4G LTE. So you will get C band on this iPhone for Verizon, so that's pretty good. Big time performance, big time battery life. The super powerful A15 Bionic chip loads apps in the flash, and it works together with an enhanced battery and iOS to boost battery life 5G not on I not 5G not on SE so this is the first iPhone SE to feature 5G so that's the main selling point of this new iPhone SE that has 5G so if you guys are looking to get a cheap iPhone with 5G the iPhone SE is the phone for you so it's from FaceTime calls and HD to multiplayer gaming 5G makes everything Feel fast and seamless when you are on the go. Made for mishaps, better drop performance, protection against Nixon Nixon crashes, resistance to coffee, tea, and soda spills, even dust. It is IP67 ready for that. A camera you will instantly click with. So the look you love, like warm or cool, and get it every time with photographic styles and see your shots on a brilliant 4.7 inch display. The home button you know and love. Touch ID is a fast, simple, and secure way to unlock your phone, sign into apps, and pay for things with the touch of a finger. A smartphone you can stand behind. Every new iPhone is designed with important innovations to help protect your privacy and 
reduce the impact on the planet. That design is outdated like a motherfucker. Like I said, that's another thing I, I don't like about this run. Is that the design is outdated. Um, it's basically an iPhone 8 with iPhone 13 hardware inside of it, basically. So if you guys are looking to get a compact iPhone, the iPhone SE is the phone for you. So, specs on here are pretty good. It has 5G Ultra Wideband, it has C band on there, it has 4G, of course, it has Wi Fi, 5G Nationwide, which is a device which, uh, which will work in over 200 countries, depending on what plan you guys have. It has iOS 15 on board, so the latest and greatest iOS version right now, and it will get, years, it will get um, updates for several years to come, so that's a plus. Uh, 12 megapixel wide camera with the f1.8 aperture digital zoom up digital zoom up to five times portrait mode with advanced bokeh and depth control 7 megapixel camera 4.7 inch display with an lcd built-in built-in rechargeable with the my own battery the width is 2.65 inches the iphone se weighs 5.9 ounces Colors, product red, midnight, and starlight. Video playback, digital uh, video uh, formats, front camera, it has portrait mode with advanced bouquet and depth control, portrait lighting with that, with six effects, neutral, studio, contour, stage, stage mono, high key mono, uses time up to 15 hours, storage options, 64 gigs. 128 gigs or 256 gigabytes of storage. The height is 5.45. The height is 5.45 ounce. The the height of the iPhone SE is 5.45 inches. The depth is 0.29 inches. The screen, like I said, 4.7 inches Retina HD display, 1334 by 750 pixel resolution at 326 ppi. It does have fast charging and also has wireless charging as well. Global and Roman Network there. Um, if you guys need help with your uh, Verizon iPhone SE, Verizon has you covered with that. It says here, Verizon wireless support helps you better understand your Verizon mobile device and other Verizon services. So um, yeah. So what comes with box is nothing special, guys. That you guys do get the iPhone SE with iOS 15 on board, USB-C to Lightning cable, and your documentation. And that is it, there is no charging brick in the box, so if you guys have an existing charging brick, use that, if not, you guys will have to get one. And like I said, the iPhone SE is also be able to be wirelessly charged as well, so it's pretty nice there. So, um, do you guys have the, the new iPhone SE? It's not here, have it, but rather than prepaid, it's available now for 429 for 64 gigs, 469 for 128 gigs or fastly on for 256 gigabytes and they're all in stock as it is video recording so that's very good and all three color options are in stock on all storage options as well so if you guys are looking to get a cheap 5G phone but you guys want an iPhone with 5G the iPhone SE is the phone for you um like I said the only thing I don't like about the new iPhone is that the design is out there like a motherfucker, but other than that, the specs are not really good. It's basically an iPhone 13 hardware in a compact design, so uh, yeah. So, do you guys have an iPhone SE? No available app, but and prepaid. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. It will help me out a lot. Please rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.